e-commerce platform Happy Fresh recently celebrated its first anniversary in Asia. The company continues to offer next hour door-to-door -door delivery and remains focused on transforming how we buy groceries. Joining us, joining us now is Isabel Pau Barrientos, Managing Director at Happy Fresh. Hello, Pau. Hi, Pau, with the traffic uh, growing, is this really your main challenge? I mean, we saw the package earlier. Yeah, about, yeah. Like, mm -hmm. yeah um, absolutely. I think it's one of the solu solutions for the um, customers in the Philippines for groceries. So you don't have to wait, you know, two hours in traffic. You don't have to pay parking. We basically, what we do is we're a food tech company that allows the customer, gives the convenience to order their fresh groceries online mm -hmm. through their app or desktop and have it delivered within the next hour. So mm -hmm. you save all the hassle of the traffic. Okay, so we do know, we did speak to your CEO mm -hmm. uh, from Singapore, I believe, the yes. last time. Um, yes. mm -hmm. And he said that we were planning to roll out around April, so it's April now, and you've mm -hmm. just arrived in the Philippines. Now, wh wh which grocery stores products can we avail on Happy Fresh? You'll be able mm -hmm. to avail of um, major grocery mm -hmm. partners and as well as um, category expansion specialists, um, wine stores, gourmet stores. So you'll see that all um, when we launch. Okay, so where do you see um, your growth opportunities within the region and in the Philippines? Okay, so we're going to start with Metro Manila. Mm -hmm. um, when, we, when we launch, we're going to cover um, most of Metro Manila, if not all. Then we, from there, our plan is to go to Greater Metro Manila, mm -hmm. and then from there expand to the major cities in the Philippines. So this will be available eventually, even in Mindanao and in uh, the Visayas? Eventually, yes. Mm -hmm. So this congestion that we mentioned could be a challenge, but it could also be a really, really strong point for you guys. Um, you don't see that the ADB did say that Metro Manila loses 2.4 billion yeah. per day yes. in traffic. Uh -huh. um, how do you plan to capitalize on that? And um, do, are you not afraid of this? Absolutely <laughs> not. That, that's, that's what we do. So uh -huh. we have an on-demand technology network that is able to um, have these drivers deliver within the next hour. So we use motorcycles with double insulated uh, boxes. So it keeps the product fresh so we can transport ice cream, uh -huh. fish, whatnot. And um, we have a, a scheduling system. It's again, um, something we do proprietarily mm -hmm. that will be able to get, get it to you within the next hour. Really? Yes. So you don't have any warehouses or do you have a supply chain management or well, any farms or warehouses? Yeah. No, as you can see, mm -hmm. uh, I think the video showed mm -hmm. it earlier. We have a personal shopper. Mm -hmm. They are trained specifically to pick products, just the way you would pick it, Sean, in, in the grocery, in the grocery store. Mm -hmm. So if you want a tomato, they're going to pick the tomato that is the right quality. They then give it to our drivers, who then deliver it directly to our customers. And you can communicate with them um, on our app. You can say then, this is the mango I want. You can blow up the screen. You can even see nutritional values. That's how you can blow up the screen as well. Wow, that's crazy. So, meaning if I want a, a mango that is going to go ripe in five days, I can actually request well, for that. Some of that you can put notes. <laughs> yeah, you some can of put them notes. is like, um, mm -hmm. you can say, uh, call me. You can say, um, if it's not good, don't do it. Or you mm -hmm. can say, replace it on your own. So okay. we're specially trained. All right. Thank you very much for that. Now, looking forward to trying out this app as I want to do my shopping in traffic. Very excited. <laughs>